So, this is the uh, first time I've recorded myself playing Madden. Uh, head kind of fell off the game since like 2016. But, uh, you know, I got back into the game this summer and thought back playing online. And this is like game maybe six online for me. And um, I decided to record it and see how it go. I know everybody's starting on Madden 20, but I got to get my skills together back in 19 first before I jump to 20. So, um, playing the Bears. And instantly I'm worried about Khalil Mack and can we, you know, keep Khalil Mack off of Lamar. But, and offensively for them, I'm only worried about uh, Tariq Cohen, not really worried about Mitchell Trubisky, and, um, you know, not really worried about the, the Bears as an offensive weapon. So I'm going through here and getting my, my packages together. And the biggest thing for me was, you know, from playing, what, Madden back in 2016 to playing Madden in 2019, was I have to use her more. I have to become a, a user player because that's the only way you're going to be successful. The only way you're going to be successful. Catching the ball, defending the ball, tackling, all that. You just got to be a user guy. You can't just pick a D lineman and, and, or a linebacker and just go now. So first play of the game, they run a little crossers. I get up under that guy. And he overthrows it. Picked by Brandon Carr. First play of the game, it's always a good sign if you can get a pick first play of the game. Now to the offensive side of the ball. Real simple. I'm real simple with it. Until you stop what I do, I'm going to stay simple. Coming out with the, uh, what? Spread set. I know with Ty Montgomery. Probably should have switched out and put Gus in there, but I didn't. Uh, short game. But I really, really forgot how fun Madden was playing online. And I, I try to bite my tongue when I play and have my headphones on. I don't want to talk as much smack. But um, I'm a smack talker. So this one, I, you know, I kind of was playing in the living room. And didn't, I had my headphones on, but I just didn't have them on my head. So there was no communication between me and the, my opponent. But now that I know how to kind of voice over it while I'm playing, you know, if I decide to put another one up, I will. Lamar scrambling, he dives, so hey, improvise. Mobile quarterback, baby. For the first down, Ty Montgomery. And again, I, I'll, I'll still probably play 19 for another month or two because I probably won't get 20 till uh, later on because I won't have the time to play it like I want to. Once I get once I get it, I definitely you know send my gamer tag out there, and I I probably put out there now so you can go ahead and be friends on um on PS4. Probing trying to find somewhere. As my phone's constantly beeping. Running inside zone again for a nice five-yard game by Ty Montgomery. Now, why did I leave Ty in the game? I, I don't know. I should have. But probably because he was a high-rated running back behind. Um, no, he's our third down back. That's what it is. He was our third down back. Got to the one, running inside zone again. So, I don't want them to switch personnel and put their heavy in. So, that's why I went no huddle. And the way I've seen the... the um. The action from Madden 20, the, you'll be able to run the ball a lot better. I don't hear the, some of the moves where they stick their foot in the ground and kind of go, kind of, you know, makes it a bad um, bad action. But in, from what I've seen so far in Madden 20, you'll be able to run the ball in, you know, real life, situ real life situations. And I saw some of the, um, the um, extra skills that some of the guys have. That's going to make the game really interesting also. Um... I think, I don't know if it was me or him that got kind of glitchy right then, so I kicked the during ball out of bounds. But still, his is second drive, and, you know, after I got the interception, I converted it into points, which is always a good thing. 
It's waiting on him. And really, I'm a, I'm a bend but don't break type dude. Unless I, unless you wanted to catch that, that run the same play over and over, and I go get that. And only when I tell people I play them, if you don't blow me out in the first quarter, a lot of times you won't win if you don't blow me out in the first quarter. Because sometimes it takes me a little longer to adjust to what you want to do. It's a good catch right there. Looking at what? First and 10 after a nice, what, 17 yard game by them? The Darius Smith on the tackle. Bring Weather down in the box. Try to cover that crosser. All right, got away from me. Overthrew it, though. Got away from me. And I was on Mosley, so we know what happened when Mosley tries to cover. And keep in mind, when I play the game, I I see a lot of I play, I play the defense the same until you make me get out of it. If I say you can't do nothing, like he keep running that same crossing route. He keep running the same crossing route. I'm going to adjust and do it. But I'm going to stay in the same defense until you make me get out of it. Basically, if I know it's a strength of my um, my team. And I, I've gotten better with the pre-snap reads, too. That kind of helped me out, too. You being able to do the pre-snap um, adjustments and things like that, especially if I think a play is going a certain way or I see a certain formation, I've done a better job at that too. But that three-year hiatus, I, I was I was horrible, horrible. Like when I first got the game in maybe January, I never even talked about it because I was trash. I was complete trash. Like every every pass was almost a pick. Uh, I was fumbling because I. The way you use the slide is now a dive, and they, the, Lamar, the ball to get kicked out of Lamar's hands. I was just complete trash, but I just you know kept playing and re started realizing I got to you know get my user skills together. That's what I did, and I looked like a first down, but it wasn't. So it's now it's gonna be fourth and one. Can my defense come up on the stop here? Let's see. Let's see. Come on, 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 come on. Fourth and one, baby. Everybody about crowding the line of scrimmage. Ah, uh, you know what? I I uh I run blitz that, and still, you know, he should have got the ball off because he had three people open. But by the time he got ready to throw it, he got slapped down. So I take it. So now we have a. Uh, we got a pick, and now we have a turnover on downs. 7 0, second possession. It's going the other way. And again, now I'm worried about Khalil Mack. So I'm trying to trying to be extremely patient and not just not just stay in the shotgun to throw the ball. Even though we, know we got okay tackles. Steal, that's Khalil Mack. And I know at this point he was waiting on me to run the ball. So that's why I hit him with two straight play actions. And it's a big mind game too. Madden's a huge mind game. Especially if you can stay in front of the sticks, the mind game will, will for the most part be in your favor. First and ten again. He went another play action. Three straight play action. Cause he waiting on me to run. I know he is. Yeah, you just gotta, you gotta stay balanced. Stay balanced. Stay away from Eddie Jackson. Stay away from Khalil Mack. That's the game plan. I call myself looking for Jackson before every snap. 
Especially if I knew I was going to throw it. So this is what, four straight play X? Touchdown. No, to the one. I'm sorry. To the one. Did I score? I can't remember if I scored here or not. I hope I did. I got to the one. Now, a lot of you guys may, some, may know something that I don't, but every time I tried to do the quarterback sneak, I was getting stopped. I was getting smacked in the mouth. So I kind of stayed away from it a little bit. So now it's, what, 13-0, going for the extra point. Damn, got that. So he took. Kick off 14 0, 348 in the second quarter. Fairly deep. He decides to bring it out. If we can get him for the 25, it's a success. He gets to the 25. The Bears offense now heading back out onto the field. Already down two touchdowns. Now, see if we can get another turnover here. 14 0, and he got the ball first. I shouldn't lose this. I shouldn't lose this game. Solid defense and match everything he does on offense. I shouldn't lose this game because I've taken the position away because I got that pick on the first play of the game. Wow! Wow! Got that pick the first play of the game. Then I, um, you know, scored on a turnover on down. So if I can match his scores from here on out, should get a victory. That was a nice run. I thought the guy was wrapped up and he did a user juke and broke the tackle. Me trying to play the underneath routes. He got a stick, got wide open, but decides to overthrow it. Tony Jefferson knocks it away, and I don't really expect Jefferson to make those plays. He's a, he's a hitter. He's a hitter. It would have been nice, though. Would have been nice. Jefferson's a box safety. I don't expect him to make them plays. Now you got third and three, and they got a full house, and they dropping the pass on that. It looked like everything covered. Ah, he got it off, though. Good tackle with uh, Weddle. They're trying to go no huddle. Still got that full house backfield. Nah, I, jumped, I jumped the crosser. I missed it, though. I had it, but I missed it. My stick skills got to get better. I read it all day. And see, this what what's, this is why I don't change defense, because this guy run the same play for the most part. So why would I change defense and give him a different look that may have a guy open? Because we're going to stuff the run. The run going to get stuffed out of this look. That's that's the least of my concerns. thing is, can I use her enough to get interceptions or passes knocked down? See, so he come with the same play again. Same play again. I... Probably had a shot at the interception, but Jimmy Smith knocked it down. Yeah, so why so why change? As a matter of fact, I think I did change on that one. I went I went rank over three. I think I did change on that one. Or man. That probably was man. I did change to give another look. We'll take that. Good pressure. Pierce. You don't look 360 in, in that film. Good pressure, Pierce. Again, so now it's fourth and nine. What are you going to do? What are you going to do? Fourth and nine. Still in the second quarter. It's early in the game. Don't do nothing crazy. Don't do anything crazy. So with him taking all this time, I'm assuming he's going for it. And he is. Right before the two-minute warning. Got a guy coming across the middle, which that's who he's trying to hit. And ah, he caught it, but need to get the first down. He did not. Good tackle. Good tackle. And I, I just, I read that play probably four times on that drive, and should have had a pick four times on that drive. But I end up with that tackle making it short, and I think a couple incompletions. 
But once I get my user skills together, I'm gonna be all right. A little inside zone, which they stuff. And I'll get better with figuring out, you know, who who's good at what and whatnot. But I got a pretty good idea of what we can do out of this formation. I try to play off Yonder's Yonder's um experience. The mm -hmm. with the scramble. Okay. Get up the sideline, buddy. Step out. Got a job. Now I have realized shh, with Lamar you can't take a lot of hits. Cause he will lay it down. Lay it down. You better slide with him and get out of bounds, because he will lay it down. Same thing, get up the sideline, buddy. They're gonna cover it and turn it back to you. Might as well. Candy from a baby. Same formation. What you not to give you no know, formation tendencies on me? They now that guy finally showed up. The guy was like not wanting to see the whole game. Finally showed up and got the sack. Uh, really, just a a tackle because we didn't lose yard at second and ten. I think I changed that play. I did. Ooh. What was my what was my um left guard? Where you going, Hurst? Ran right past a guy. Oh no, that's Lewis. I'm sorry. Not Hurst, that's Lewis. What was he, where was he going? And I got sacked. Ooh, it's off the edge. Came with a little nickel blitz. I didn't see it coming. And that put me at what? Fourth and 18. Did I go for it? I think I went for it. I didn't want to kick a long field goal. So, yeah, I went for it. Did I get it? I don't know. We're about to see, huh? Probably should have subbed um, Boyle out for a better receiving tight end. And I did not get it. Why I didn't throw that ball, I don't know. I guess I was just trying to run the clock out. I think that's what I was trying to do, just run the clock out. So I left them two seconds, and they're going to throw a Hail Mary, and it's going to be um, knocked down, I think. I think it's going to be knocked down. I tried to force them to throw it early by rushing subs. That tip scared the be Jesus out of me. When it went up in the air like that, I was nervous. Well, I was nervous. So now I get the ball back, and he hasn't scored yet. So in my mind, I'm I'm in full control. Just don't don't screw this up. Don't screw it up. And so um, I'm sitting there waiting, waiting, chit chatting, you know, checking my phone. Like, what's going on? Why 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 the game ain't started yet? So then it hits me. Dude, probably finna quit. And as you see what's going on on the screen now, he decides to quit. Sorry, sap sucker. But this is my first recording, and I won. <laughs> Let's <laughs> go.